What's up guys, my name is Cooper, back with another video. This time I'm doing an achievement guide, the What Are They Worth achievement in Resident Evil 4, which you get for completing, or er, getting all the bottle caps. You see, you can decide between A, B, C, D, each one increasing in difficulty, and I'm, I really impressed myself with, um, my accuracy in this. At least in the beginning, I kind of start to suck later on. Anyways, all you have to do is shoot all these targets, you can choose between two different, um, ammo types, or, uh, weapon types, which is rapid fire and sniping, or, uh, whatever the hell it's called. And there you see I just got three bottle caps, shot just about everyone in the head, I think I only missed one. Anyways, in the rapid fire one, you get a shotgun and, P uh, and a TMP, which I realized is really hard to aim with. Oh dear god, I hate Ashley. Leon! Leon! Anyways, and the uh, single fire sniping, whatever the hell it's called, I don't even know, um, comes with a bolt action rifle and your handgun that you start out with in the beginning of the game, which is much easier to aim with than the, uh, ha er, than the TMP. And this is all in two times speed, by the way, if you could not tell. So just play A until you unlock everything in the first row, then play B until you unlock everything in the second row, and the objective is to get the highest score. Shooting five enemies in a row will get you that extra target, which, if you hit it, is worth 500 points. If you hit the guys in the head, it's worth 100. There, I got the target again. And I hit it. And if you shoot the women in the head, you get 200. If you shoot either the guys or the women in the chest, or anywhere else for that matter, oh wow, I got a high score there, 4300, you'll only get 50. There will also be an Ashley target on either the B or the C one, I forget which, where it starts at, that if you hit it, uh, it'll subtract 1000 points from your score, so you might as well give up if you hit that and start, uh, and try again. And as you can see, I just unlocked the three different Leon bottle caps here. Oh, he's so awesome, isn't he? Anyways, uh, let's see if I can read it right quick. Uh, sniping, yeah, it's called sniping. Okay, so I completed A, going for B, I'm not sure how much money I got there, but you do get money for completing each row, so I'd say it's worth it. This only took me, yeah, uh, Ashley pops up, in the second row. Got that target. This only took me about 20 minutes to complete. There are 24 bottle caps in all. And so that would be, what is that, six on each? Um, no, that wouldn't be six. Oh, no, there are a bunch of bottle caps. And there are three of these rooms where you can try to, and I just missed that completely because I suck. Uh, there are three of these rooms where you can uh, try this. One's in the castle, or three of them are in the castle, actually. And the first one you come across, you can try out A and get no further than that. The second one, you can try out A and B. The third one, you can try out A, B, and C. And the fourth one, which is on the island, which is where I am, you can try out all four of them, A, B, C, and D. Which I'd suggest doing, because then you can just get all out of the way at once if you're going for the achievement. Also, you get a whole bunch of money all at once, too. So, that's always useful. And I believe in one of these, I went over and tried the rapid fire just to see if I could, like, actually hit the targets like there. I was shooting all around its head. Anyways, as you see here, uh, my accuracy just continues to go down. I think I actually missed that one target as I play. And I shot him in the head rather than shooting the dynamite because I'm an idiot. And I completely missed that, but I do sh shoot the dynamite stick there. And I managed to shoot the target in the background that last time. Got two bottle caps, hit pause by accident. And which two did I get? I got the other uh, Ganado and the Chainsaw Dude from the village, if you remember. Alright, so that completed the second row, so now all I have to do from now on is I forgot to cut that part out because I'm an idiot, 
Yeah, here's where I try the rapid fire one. And I learned that the TMP is very hard to aim with, although, if I recall, I don't do too bad there. You saw I just selected A rather than B. Apparently, um, oh yeah, I was missing one bottle cap on the B thing. Yeah, so here I am just going back and trying to get the last bottle cap on B. And if you didn't know, they get progressively harder, so C will have more of the Ashland mannequins. And they decide to pop up all of them way back in the back of the room, so it was impossible for me to aim at. But I did a pretty decent job of it. Got, uh, 3,000 as my score. Got one bottle cap. And row two was completed. Got 25 grand from that. I believe I got 1,500 from the, uh, completing A. And let's see, just, um, the two chainsaw sisters, I believe, is the bottle cap. No, that's later. Yes, that is right now. The Bella sisters is the bottle cap you get right at the end there. Or that I got, at least. I think it's kind of random, if I'm not mistaken, uh, what bottle caps you get. Anyways, there, I just selected the wrong one. On purpose, obviously. <laughs> obviously. Anyways, uh, like I said before, it's pretty darn easy to hit him in the head. And with these later ones, like I did there, uh, you'll have to stand off to the side a little if you want to aim at all of them. Because, you know, sometimes they actually things pop up right there in front and you gotta shoot around them. Because the target may be back behind them. And those sparkler things make it just impossible to hit the target back there. I believe that's called the Salazar tablet. Got 4,300 points on that. Five bottle caps. That's the best round I've done, and it's all downhill from there. Now, let's see which ones I got. All the dudes from the castle, almost. And one guy from the village with a parasite sprout out of his head. Zealot with shield. And I noticed in that round, there was just one guy that I did not shoot in the head, I believe. Which, if I had gotten that, I probably could have unlocked every single bottle cap in that one round. Which would have been pretty cool, completing the whole thing in one round. And I did not really have a problem with A, B, C, or D. And as you can see here, I did not uh, make this go two times speed because I'm an idiot and I'm a stupid face. And um, yeah, now here we go for two times speed because I messed that recording up. Oh well, uh, you know, post-editing. This is post-commentary, past the post-editing, because I don't really feel like editing it anymore. I'm just commentating over what I've already edited, and I did not review it very well. As you see, I just had a hell of a time trying to shoot that one guy. Anyways, did not try that hard. I just wanted to shoot every one of them to get the last bottle cap. Third row complete, $3,500, no, $35,000. Pesetas, wherever the hell they're called, I don't even know what they're called. And I got the Merchant. Conceited douche. You know he's conceited when he gives you a bottle cap of himself. Anyway, sticking with Rapid Fire. Um, both Rapid Fire and... Not, I'm not sticking with Rapid Fire, I'm sticking with Sniping. Both Rapid Fire and Sniping come with a grenade, but I've never found that useful. Because whenever it warrants grenade, and I shoot Ashley in the face because I feel like it. Shot both of them. Right around that target. You know, you really can't resist shooting Ashley. I mean, it's, it's just too much of an opportunity. And as you can see here on the D setting, um, I have a hell of a time trying to do this because I just shot another Ashley and I have to start over. Because that's deducting a thousand points from your score. So that's that's just not worth it. I can do much better than that. Anyways, it just takes a bit of time. If I had not messed this up, it probably... I probably would have completed this achievement in about 15 minutes. As you can see here, now they're... Now they're playing tricks on me, going back and forth around her. I don't know why you go in front of her. And there, I just shot him in the head, so I quickly try to shoot all of them in the chest, because shooting them is better than not... Or than missing them, but... 
doesn't really matter because I shot Ashley in the process. <sighs> I hate her so much. She she isn't the worst NPC in any game. I'm not saying that. I'm saying she's one of the most annoying. I know there are more annoying ones, but she's right up there. Anyways, here I think I believe this is the one where I'm going to complete it. No, I shot Ashley. I go on a vicious rampage and shoot around the room. There we go. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this is one where I actually do complete it and get quite a decent score from it. And shoot the little Salazar thing. Salazar target, I'm, I believe it's called. I remember when I first played this on Nintendo 64. Not the Nintendo 64. That would be amazing if the N64 could run this on the GameCube. One of those products by Nintendo. Yay! 3400 unlocked four prizes. Um, we had a memory card that had a save file with a few million dollars, the infinite rocket launcher, and all of the bottle caps. And we were like, "Oh my God, this guy's so pro." He is so amazing! I forgot to equip sniping. And, um, we tried to get the bottle caps before when I was playing this first. That was like eight years ago. Forgive me, I was ten years old and I just shot Ashley, so I decided to shoot her again. And reset. Anyways. Um, yeah, I could never complete this when I was ten, which I missed one of the targets there, which just shows how horrible I was at video games. And I believe I just horribly missed the Salazar ta er, target and the other guy. I can't really tell because my editor is lagging. I'm just using Audacity to record over this. I have to move over to shoot that target, but I missed him. Didn't get an opportunity to shoot him, so it doesn't really matter. And one last guy. There you go. The last two bottle caps that you need. End it. And... I get how much money? Fourth row complete? There you go! What are they worth? Achievement unlocked. And I got 50 grand for completing that. So I definitely say that was worth it. If you want to waste 20 minutes of your life, you can go ahead and do that. But I'd recommend waiting till the island to get it all over with. All in one go! Got the soldier with the stun rod and the big giant fat dude with the giant hammer. Soldier with hammer. Kind of pussies because one shot to the head kills him. Anyways, that's all for now. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.